My name is Jenna, and I discovered angel longevity through a really good friend of mine who was battling with a number of different things. And um, I was coming out of COVID feeling pretty miserable. Um, I started to think that I was experiencing long-term COVID. And I contacted a friend who I knew was seeking a you know, naturopathic uh, remedy and uh, guidance. And she mentioned Dr. Mather to me and said, you know, I, she's wonderful. I, I really love her because she's looking at the whole body. She's looking at the whole person. She's really um, trying to identify things in a really holistic, um, natural approach. I came to Angel Longevity uh, and met with Dr. Mather right off the bat. I felt um, very comfortable and at home. And I felt like I was meeting with someone who really cares about um, the person, you know, not just the symptom or what can we do to band-aid the symptom, but actually what investigation can we make into figuring out what's really going on. And so that was where my journey began. So I started in late July, uh, 2022, and I came here with coming out of, of having COVID and starting to feel like it was the beginning of sort of a long COVID. I just, even though I wasn't testing positive anymore, I wasn't, you know, having the, the symptoms of fever and and so on and so forth. I felt like something was dragging me down every single day. And so that was my initial response was I just thought, oh, let me go get an IV and get rid of this. She told me about bioidentical hormones and so uh, the, the sort of journey and investigation began there. Um, another thing that I had never even occurred to me was food allergies. So right away, we talked about um, anything that I was sensitive to, and you know, we did a whole lab uh, deep dive into uh, things that I was allergic to, which it just seems so logical to me. Like, yeah, let's identify what your body does, you know, insensitive to or just allergic to and let's eliminate and and I and I love that holistic approach but again it wasn't about me ingesting something to prevent or to band-aid symptoms it was actually like let's look into what's your body's not you know can't manage and get rid of it let's just lose you know just stop incorporating it into your daily diet and so I um, we found out what I we identified what I was allergic to and um, and agreed that it was probably best for me to go on a non gluten sugar dairy alcohol kind of program. Uh, I saw changes within literally one to two weeks. Um, my energy improved tenfold. Um, I slept better. Um, I'm big on bowel movement elimination positivity, so I'm going to say that I that was working out better for me um, and um, I just felt better overall um, and then alongside that we were doing in, you know in investigating into bioidenticals and I started to take that and found that my anxiety reduced tremendously I was having anxiety and I didn't really know why I didn't have any reason to be sort of sort of anxious and I, and that started to get worked out my moods are more balanced my sleep is much better. Um, it's improved, and um, and I just I really feel better as I approach fifty than I did when I was approaching forty. To be honest. Well, Doctor Mather, I just thank you so much. I appreciate you for uh, your wisdom, your uh, openness to learn, to uh, listen to each individual person person's story and and apply um, you know a program that is unique to that person you know one size does not fit all in the medical world and sadly that's sort of how it feels when you're out there at times not all the time but at times and I feel that you um, really are you know listening and and creating programs that are tailored to that person's needs um, I really love the holistic approach. I, I really appreciate the focus on nutrition and healing um, with food, using food as medicine. And the nutritional support from Christina has been tremendous as well. Um, 
And I hoped that more and more people come to you. <laughs> I'm setting up your way to see you know, though, because I want people to feel as good as I feel. And I want people to know that, you know, just by eliminating certain things in your life doesn't mean it's over. Thankfully, we live in a world where, you know, being vegan is kind of, you know, it's, 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 it's kind of in vogue. So there's, because of that, there's a lot of new products out there. I mean, different foods that, you know, dips and things for me like that I love, you know, baked goods, things that if you still want to have those sorts of things in your life, you can. Um, and uh, you just, uh, you know, I think the, the focus on um, a healthy mind and a healthy spirit and a healthy body that you are are really inviting people to believe in and to think about for themselves is really, it's tremendously rewarding and I thank you so much for it. <laughs>